Hello everyone, this is a video tutorial of the three arm relay number two exercise. As with uh, any three arm relay exercise, uh, the things that you should be most careful about is uh, maintaining all three instruments within the field of view. Number one, number two, always grasping your um, object uh, with uh, like a parallel angle between the tip of your instrument and uh, the actual object. Uh, this is a little bit more challenging in this exercise since uh, contrary to the three arm relay number one exercise, the objects are spaced in such a way that it's a little bit more challenging for you to grasp them at a parallel angle. However, try to maintain that as much as possible, even if it's not completely parallel. Uh, besides that, uh, the basics with every three arm relay exercise is you get a button on the left side of your left foot which you can press with the lateral side of your foot and this will allow you to exchange instruments uh, instantaneously. Uh, again, as the three arm relay exercises get a little bit more complex, you're going to have a little bit more difficulty uh, kind of uh, managing all three instruments at once. Uh, the exercise is not going to take points away if you take a little bit more time to reposition your instruments. However, it is going to subtract points uh, if uh, you pause to reposition the object by using a second arm. That is, if I were to pause and use another arm to reposition the, uh, the object uh, so that I may get a more parallel angle uh, between the tip of my instrument and the object, the exercise might subtract points from that. Uh, as it delays the overall uh, exercise and uh, you lose points uh, from uh, fluency. Uh, that's all. Thank you.